Hi everyone and welcome to my video. Today I'm joined by the gorgeous MacGyver, the Labrador Cross Golden Retriever and his bro bud, the Doberman. As I was painting their pop art portraits, I filmed a bit of how Bud's portrait came to life on the canvas. And today I wanted to let you know what colour I used to achieve Bud's beautiful black fur and also let you know more about these pair of pups. Enjoy! For black dogs like Bud, I use a paint colour called Payne's Grey, which is a dark blue-grey. This colour is named after William Payne, a watercolour artist from the late 18th century, and it's a much more vibrant colour than just black. When it's mixed with titanium white, you get these lovely blue shades which I use to create depth in a dog's fur. In the Italia paint range, Payne's Grey is made from a mixture of ultramarine and carbon black. I use it so much that it's easier for me to buy in the tube. I'm sure there are many other ways to paint a dog's black fur, however for my style of pop art, I find that Payne's Grey works really well with the bright colour palette I use and gives black dogs a richness to their colourings. Here's a time lapse of how I use this colour on Bud the Doberman. To start a pop art painting, I block in the dark areas of the dog using straight Payne's Grey. Dobermans have a very sleek fur as they were developed through mixing many breeds like the Rottweiler, GSP, Weimarana, Manchester Terrier, Beauceron, Great Dane, Black and Tan Terrier and even the Greyhound. Next I start adding white to the Payne's Grey to add in another layer of dark colour blocks. When I've built up the base layer of colour, we'll jump over to the detail. This is where I use the lighter shades of Payne's Grey to really show the highlights in his fur. You will see as well, I use carbon black for dog noses, which contrasts nicely with the Payne's Grey. The Doberman was developed in the 1880s in Germany, created by Herr Karl Louis Doberman, a tax collector who needed a dog that would help him feel safe when travelling around with large amounts of money. Dobermans are extremely intelligent and these days are used for search and rescue, police work, therapy dogs and of course make amazing pets. As they move further away from their guard dog roots, Dobermans are loving and gentle pups. I'm told Bud here is a bit of a sook, so I've painted him with a doe-eyed expression. Don't you just want to give him a hug? Happy MacGyver over here does his best to try and make up for his brother not being a guard dog. He's a bundle of fun with a big grin on his face. Thank you for tuning into my video of all the details of how I painted Bud the Doberman. And of course, a special thanks to his mate, MacGyver, the Labrador Cross Retriever. If you too would like your pups immortalised in hand-painted pop art, please feel welcome to contact me. All the details are on my website, popartpuppydogs.com. Until next time, from me, Bud and MacGyver, we'll catch you later.